हेलो स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस चैप्टर टू द नर्दर्न माउंटेन वॉल द टॉपिक विच वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस टुडे इज लाइफ इन द नर्दर्न माउंटेन्स फर्स्ट वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट जम्मू एंड कश्मीर इट इज द क्राउन ऑफ इंडिया एज यू नो इट लाइज इन द नॉर्थ एंड द शेप ऑफ जम्मू एंड कश्मीर लुक्स लाइक अ क्राउन सो इट इज द क्राउन ऑफ इंडिया it lies in the lap of himalayas here the himalayan mountain range is there so it lies in the lap of himalayas it is called paradise on earth paradise means heaven the place is so beautiful that it is also called heaven on earth in august 2019 means previous year it was bifurcated bifurcated means divided into two separate parts jammu and kashmir was bifurcated into two union territories now it is not a state it is bifurcated means divided into two union territories one is jammu and kashmir other one is ladakh so when the jammu and kashmir was bifurcated into two union territories in august 2019 name the two union territories jammu and kashmir and ladakh shrinagar has famous dal lake shrinagar has a famous place means a famous lake that is known as dal lake this lake is the beauty of kashmir you can find a large number of house boats and shikaras in this lake house boats are used for lodging and shikaras are used for selling flowers and vegetables main occupation is agriculture means agriculture is the main occupation of the people who are living in jammu and kashmir terraced farming or terraced fields terraced field or terrace farming means growing of crops on a level of steps or terraces on a hill side that is known as terraced fields growing of crops on level of steps or terraces on a hill side that is known as terraced fields there they produce rice maize and rajma some people practice animal rearing animal rearing means where animals are raised for meat fiber milk eggs and other products animal rearing means where animals are raised for meat fiber milk eggs and other products and grazing grazing means when animal uh, go and eat their food means like grass that is grazing people in kashmir jammu and kashmir they mainly speak three languages that is kashmiri dogri and urdu kashmiri dogri and urdu the carpets and pashmina shawls of kashmir are very famous pashmina is a very fine variety of wool shawls are being made of this and it is world famous the carpets and pashmina shawls are world famous of kashmir popular dress for both men and women is firan firan is a long woolen loose gown which people wear they also keep kangri you know what is kangri kangri is a small earthen pot in that pot burning coal is there to keep them warm to keep themselves warm they keep burning coal in that small earthen pot sometimes uh, they put this kangri under the firan also so what is firan a long woolen loose gown and kangri is a small earthen pot with burning coal in it under the firan also they keep kangri sometimes why to keep themselves warm kava kava is a famous a special kind of tea this is the special drink of kashmiris kava 
फेमस प्लेसेस आर श्रीनगर गुलमर्ग फलगम अमरनाथ केव वैष्णो देवी टेम्पल दीज आर द फेमस प्लेसेस इन जम्मू एंड कश्मीर श्रीनगर गुलमर्ग फालगम अमरनाथ केव वैष्णो देवी टेम्पल मेन फेस्टिवल ऑफ द पीपल लिविंग इन जम्मू एंड कश्मीर इज ईद एंड शिवरात्रि ईद एंड शिवरात्रि एज यू कैन सी दिस द टू यूनियन टेरिटरीज जम्मू एंड कश्मीर एंड लद्दाख इन टू थाउजेंड नाइनटीन द जम्मू एंड कश्मीर स्टेट वॉज बाइफरकेटेड इन टू टू यूनियन टेरिटरीज दिस इज द एग्जैक्ट मैप यू कैन से हिमाचल प्रदेश कैपिटल ऑफ हिमाचल प्रदेश इज शिमला कैपिटल इज शिमला मेन ऑक्यूपेशन ऑफ द पीपल हु आर लिविंग इन हिमाचल प्रदेश इज फार्मिंग मैनी पीपल रियर गोट शीप मेन क्रॉप्स आर राइस बार्ले एंड मेज एंड मेन फ्रूट्स विच आर ग्रोन इन हिमाचल प्रदेश प्लम्स एंड एप्पल्स क्रॉप्स आर राइस बार्ले मेज फ्रूट्स आर प्लम्स एंड एप्पल मेन लैंग्वेजेस पहाड़ी एंड हिंदी लैंग्वेजेस पहाड़ी एंड हिंदी पॉपुलर फेस्टिवल ऑफ हिमाचल प्रदेश द शेरा पॉपुलर फेस्टिवल द शेरा देर आर थ्री मेन हिल स्टेशन कुल्लू मनाली वेरी फेमस कुल्लू मनाली एंड शिमला कुल्लू मनाली एंड शिमला वुमेन वियर पजामास विद अ लॉन्ग टॉप women wear pajamas with a long top they wear a scarf also the scarf is called dhazu men wear tight pajama with loose shirt what women wear they wear pajama but with a long top men also wear but they wear very tight pajama with a loose shirt women also wear a scarf that scarf is called dhazu you can see the states over here हिमाचल प्रदेश टू यूनियन टेरिटरीज जम्मू कश्मीर एंड लद्दाख वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस नाउ उत्तराखंड फर्स्ट सम स्टार फैक्ट्स अबाउट कश्मीर कश्मीर इज कॉल्ड ऑर्किड्स ऑफ इंडिया वाई कश्मीर इज कॉल्ड द ऑर्किड्स ऑफ इंडिया बिकॉज वेराइटी ऑफ फ्रूट्स आर फाइंड हेयर लाइक एप्पल चेरी एप्रिकॉट plum pear walnut and almonds these are variety of fruits which are found in kashmir so it is known as orchids of india the soil and climate of himachal pradesh are well suited for apple cultivation It means apples are mainly found in himachal pradesh so there are three varieties of apple which is grown in himachal pradesh royal delicious golden delicious and rich red these three are the varieties well known varieties which are grown here of apple himachal pradesh has the highest cricket ground in the world at chail at chail himachal pradesh has the highest cricket ground now we are going to discuss about uttarakhand capital of uttarakhand dehradun ganga and yamuna originate in uttarakhand there are two rivers which are originating in uttarakhand that is ganga and yamuna main occupation of the people living in uttarakhand is agriculture main occupation of the people is agriculture many people also join army many people have joined army also here dehradun is also known for the indian military academy dehradun means capital of uttarakhand it is also known for the indian military academy hill stations which are mainly found in uttarakhand are masuri and nainital other famous places are haridwar almora badrinath and kedarnath haridwar almora badrinath and kedarnath main languages are hindi and garhwali hindi and garhwali Sikkim Sikkim has been derived from the word Sukkim Sukkim means happy homeland Sikkim has derived from the word Sukkim which means happy homeland Capital of Sikkim is Gangtok Capital of Sikkim is Gangtok Gangtok mainly means flattened hill 
Kanchanjunga is the third largest peak in the Himalayas. It lies in the Sikkim only. Most of the people living here are Buddhist. The people who are living in Sikkim are Buddhist. Rumtek Monastery is a landmark of Sikkim. Rumtek is a name. Monastery means a place which is reserved for the prayers. Means where monks or nuns, they live in communities where the prayers are done of the God, of the Buddha. So, Rumtek Monastery is a landmark of Sikkim. The mask da dance of Sikkim is very famous. The people wear mask and they perform dance. So, the mask dance of Sikkim is very famous. So, Sikkim has been derived from a word Sukkim, which means happy homeland. This is Sikkim. Now, we are going to talk about Darjeeling. It is in the north of West Bengal, here is Darjeeling. It is famous hill station and Darjeeling tea is world famous. What is famous of Darjeeling? Tea. The Tiger Hill is a place worth visiting. The Tiger Hill is a place in Darjeeling which is worth visiting. Northeastern states. Now we are talking about the northeastern states. Group of seven states are there in the northeast. They are also known as seven sisters. These are the seven states. Please take a look. Arunachal Pradesh, Assam, Meghalaya, Nagaland, Manipur, Tripura, Mizoram. These states are called seven sisters. And Assam is the largest state among the seven sisters. Capital of Assam is Dispur and Assam is also very famous for its tea. Main festival of Assam is Bihu and the people mainly speak Assamese here. The language they speak is Assamese. Larger state, capital Dispur, famous for tea. Main festival Bihu, people speak Assamese. Next we are going to talk about Arunachal Pradesh. Capital of Arunachal Pradesh is Itanagar. The Brahmaputra River enters India through Arunachal Pradesh. In Uttarakhand, which two rivers are there? Ganga and Yamuna. In Arunachal Pradesh, which river enters? Brahmaputra enters into India through Arunachal Pradesh. The people also depends upon agriculture and forest produce for their livelihood. The people here depends totally upon agriculture and forest produce for their livelihood, for their survival. They depend upon these two things. Capital of Nagaland. Now Nagaland we are going to discuss. Capital of Nagaland is Kohima. The Nagas are mainly farmers and hunters. Means the people living in Nagaland are called Nagas. They are mainly farmers or hunters. They wear very colorful clothes. Meghalaya. Capital of Meghalaya is Shillong. The word Meghalaya means abode of clouds. Abode means where the clouds are there. Means a place to live means where the clouds are. Mainly clouds are there. That's why it is known as Meghalaya. Meg means clouds. Most people belong to Garo, Khasi and Jentai tribes. There are three tri tribal people live over Meghalayas. Garo, Khasi and Jentai tribes. Mizoram. Mizoram means the land of hill people. Mizoram means the land of the hill people. Capital of Mizoram is Aizol. Capital of Mizoram is Aizol. Most of the people are educated in Mizoram. Most of the people who are living in Mizoram are well educated. Manipur. Capital of Manipur is Imphal. Capital of Manipur is Imphal. Manipur is in the south of Nagaland. You can see the map. The Manipur is in the south of Nagaland. Main occupation is farming and weaving. The main occupation is farming and weaving. Famous dance of Manipur is Manipuri dance. Manipuri dance. Manipuri also make bamboos, cane and leather goods. They also make bamboo, cane and leather goods. Tripura. The word Tripura means the three cities. The three. Three means three. Pura means cities. The Tripura word means the three cities. 
Tripura is surrounded on three sides by Bangladesh. It is surrounded on its three sides by Bangladesh. The fourth side, it shares a common boundary with Assam and Mizoram. On the fourth side, the Tripura shares a common boundary with Assam also and Mizoram also. Capital of Tripura is Agartala. Capital of Tripura is Agartala. Mainly people speak language over here is Bengali or Kokburak. Kokburak means the tribal language of Tripura. Bengali and Kokburak. Main crops jute, cotton and oil seeds. Main crop is jute, cotton and oil seeds. Bamboo is mainly used for making huts, toys and handicrafts. Huts, toys and handicrafts. So, in this means whole video, you have to learn the states and the capitals, their main festivals, the language they speak over here. Please listen and understand the PPT very carefully and please revise it also. Thank you and have a nice day.